How you doing? I got my rake, but we'll get to that in a minute. So yesterday, if you saw me do that little walkthrough, <coughs> I was talking about uh, erosion control here, and we're gonna be doing some of that right now. But first I'm gonna show you, we're gonna mix up some custom blends. What I have here is a, a bag of uh, field peas. This is what you would plant, plant out to feed ca cows or cattle in the early spring. Also good for nit nitrogen fixing in your soil. So what I'm making up is two batches. And what else we're gonna put in here in this first test area is some wild oats. Oh, and look, there's a weird seed in there. See that? I don't know what that is. We could get lucky. So we're gonna add some wild oats to our erosion control, which is more food. So these peas, when they grow, we can eat the flowers, we can eat the shoots, we can eat the peas as we're walking up and down here. It'd be delicious. And then the oats, when the oats go milky, we can make milky oat tincture uh, for medicine. And the UPS guy just came. So we'll be right back. And we're back. And we got the package. So what I put in here so far is peas and oats. And for the first batch, we're gonna also add some of this. Which is a wild barley. So we got oats, and barley, and peas. And that's our mix. I'm even just gonna go real quick here and throw in some of this. Black seed, just a little bit, just in an experiment. So now I'm gonna mix it up, and then uh, I'm gonna broadcast seed this. So if you just follow me, Alan, I'm gonna start at the bottom of this patch and move my way up. So a couple things you're gonna to want to note: if it's really windy, you're gonna to want to be downwind. So if you don't know how to check the wind, you just get some grass and you let it go like this. And so the wind is blowing that way, which is pretty good. It's not that um, strong here. So I'm just gonna make sure I get to the bottom and get all these seeds. And I'm just gonna Johnny Appleseed them. It takes a little time to figure out how to do this right and get them thin, because you don't want big piles. But, and then you can go a few directions as you're broadcast seeding to make sure you get them everywhere. And a couple other tips. This is a slope here, so you can put it a little heavier up top, because I'm gonna rake this. And I'm about to show you that right in a second here, as soon as I get this seed out. And this is kind of an overseed con uh, condition where it doesn't really matter what I'm doing there. Okay, so then, what you want to do is, uh, if you come down here a little close, you just want to get a rake on this and turn the soil. This I got. You don't have to really worry about who's getting buried or who isn't, as long as you roll the soil in. The object is to get the majority of these seeds under the soil. Some of them are going to be up top. Okay, so we've raked these in pretty nice. Just mark where we seeded so that we know we have to seed this. And then, you're gonna wanna come and, you're gonna wanna mulch this pretty heavily. And then if you have the ability, obviously water it, or do this before it rains. And that way this, the mulch doesn't blow away. <laughs> so you're looking at, we'll probably put a little bit more mulch in this on there. Maybe two inches. And I would say that's pretty optimal, the way we've done it there. So we've got a couple more mixes we're gonna do. You can use a lot of different seeds. We have, you can buy this in the bird food section. Safflower, you can plant sunflower. Whatever seed that you can get that's cheap, that you can get in bulk. Now, these peas, come check this out and show them in there. These peas we got at a commodities dealer and they're uh, about $60 for a, a whole 50 pound bag. And this barley uh, at the commodities dealer probably goes for 12 bucks for 50 pounds. So you really, you can buy organic wheat 
in a 50 pound bag for like 30 bucks. You can buy organic oats. And it doesn't really matter what you plant. Make sure that what you're planting is what you want. Like we want milky oats here. We want some flax so that the bees are here. And we want erosion control so we're, you know, we're planting peas too. And that's going to help make the soil better. So get at it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel and share this with like-minded people.